Hey everyone, welcome to Castle Hives. Brian here. We're in the apiary. We have some winter preparation work to do today. Hey everybody, so welcome to Castle Hives. Uh, my name is Brian. So what we're doing today is I have my mouse guards that I'm gonna put on the front of the hives. Uh, I'm also going to reduce down the entrance. So they have entrance reducers on the hives now that is, I forget the number of inches that it is, but then there's also a smaller entrance on those wooden entrance reducers. So we're just gonna uh, pop that bottom, switch that entrance uh, reducer down. We're gonna screw on these mouse guards. And then I'm also going to put my winter patties and uh, some of the sugar bricks in the top Vivaldi boards. So, um, and you know, while I'm here talking, look at this. This little girl decided to come visit me. She wanted to be a, a, a YouTube star, but you see on her right there, look at that. I don't know where she's gotten it, but she's got pollen. Nice orange pollen there. Look at that. So cool. Yeah. But, uh, oh, there she goes, trying to fly. She's got some full boots. There she went, she fell right down there. But uh, let's get main castle. Um, let's start the work there, and then let's just move over. So this is like in those final stages. And then the last thing that I'm gonna do is uh, get my wraps on these hives. So mouse guards, uh, reduce down that entrance a little bit more, um, put the, the winter, uh, you know, more or less emergency feed in, so to say. Um, and then the last step will be wrap and everything will be set for the hives here. So really looking forward then to seeing how they come into spring. So, but let's get over to Main Castle Hive. All right, y'all. Let's get these screws out. Okay, y'all, so you saw from that other larger entrance, now they just have, well, they can sneak in over there, and they just have that small little hole right there. And then this, get on in there, girl. This is going to go right there. So if I can, let me slide this down so that they have two holes to get into. There we go. Lined up perfect. Okay. Lined up perfect. There we go. All right. Now, let's get up into the Vivaldi board now. So, what I'm probably going to do, now I have my winter patties in here. Okay. There's one right there. All right. Throw a little score marks on this, right like that, okay? Now, I have my sugar bricks here, and let me get up into here, and I'll show you all the benefit of working these Vivaldi's, is that I can open this up and just put this in here, and I see the girls all down in there. I do, I do, I do. Look at that now. So I get that in there, but what I'm gonna do also is this. I'm gonna crack this uh, inner cover, and 
this pollen patty, well, winter patty, is going to get split. There we go. And I'm going to put one part here, one part there. Good, good, good. Now, what I also am going to do, set aside from this, I'm probably going to get, I have a bag of sugar, and I'm going to dump just a little bit of sugar in there. So let me get that. I'll be right back. All right. And I'll be able to do this in the winter time as well. Okay, and all that I do now is just move that so that it goes down in there. Okay, this hive set. Now put the burlap back on. Good. Good deal. Main castle is done. Let's get on to Buckingham. And again, this right here is just emergency feeding, supplement. Your bees should already have everything they need at this point. So, like I said before, if you're looking to use this as a, well, they can make it, uh, you know, this is, this is, last resort and hopefully they should tap into this more or less really in uh march Ooh, dumped a little bit in there that's okay they'll clean it all right there we go my burlap on and Buckingham's done so looking good looking good let's move on to uh, the bee box the poly hive all right so you can see here on the poly hive with the entrance that it has on it all I really have to do is slide this while wow, they have that propolized good but there's already a guard on here. So this hive, I really am impressed with it. Now let's look at the top and see what I've done. Okay, y'all, so in the top here, what I've done is I have the top feeder, okay? And I took the guard off so you can see some bees in there. Let me crack this, okay? Wow, they don't like being bothered. But what I'm gonna do is put the food right up here for them, that way they have an entrance it's insulated with the poly. So let me get this up there for them. You can see the girls in there flying.
great. So the poly hive is gonna get set up right like this, okay? You can see the girls here, so they have access up. They have their winter patty there. Um, we'll see. This hive is super packed also, so I'm really not that concerned as far as them, you know, having to work their way up and things like that. So this hive is uh, it's doing a wonderful job. So let's move over to the bee castle. Okay, so I opened up the bee castle and look at this in that screened in area. Look at all the girls down in there. So they're gonna get a treat. Uh, let's see what they do with this here. Let's take that off and let's put some of the sugar in. There we go. And then the sugar patty is gonna go down beneath. Okay. Now the uh, winter patty is gonna go underneath. So let's move this inner cover. I fully expect the girls to get a little bit not happy with me. Look at that cluster. Look at that cluster. There we go. That's that. So I'm just going to put the burlap back and uh, Bee Castle is done. All right, everybody. So I got the uh, four Langstroth hives here done. Um, they have a winter patty. They have some sugar bricks, some other dry sugar. They all have, you know, decent population. There's a little bit of activity today. It's 58 sunny. Um, I have the hive at the farmer's property to do yet, but overall, you know, we're looking good so i'm supplementing you know right now just so that when it gets into that deep of the cold you know if they end up needing a supplement they have it um that's it it's not necessary some people choose to do so some people don't so but that's just what i do here at castle hive so um if you all want to keep following beekeeping you know into the winter and then see how each of these hives come into the spring and then i split them keep following along. Hit that like on the video and subscribe also. So I appreciate everybody watching. Um, everybody take care. Have a good day. And until the next video.